Okay, if you're using uh, Salt, uh, after you click on that option, uh, if it's not already showing the distribution calculators here, uh, for example, if it's showing something else, you click the distribution calculators. This distribution selection, you do the drop down, you choose binomial um, distribution. Now, I'm, I'm going to work a couple different problems than, than what you have. Um, just to give you an example. Uh, your in is your number of trials. Uh, so I'll put nine in there. <clears throat> P is a probability of success on a single trial. So that's 20%. So I'll put 20% in there. Now the equals. Now this says R and that says X, but um, same idea. So probability that R is equal to 3. If I come over here, the equals is this option here, the equals. And then I put 3 in there. There's really nothing to do. Your answer is right here. Now, let's do those same numbers with uh, probably the R or X is greater than or equal to 2. Now, greater than or equal to 2, that would be the right tail. And it's pretty easy to see. Once you choose it, um, then you'll see whether it says X is less than or equal to or greater than or equal to. For example, if I choose left tail, you see it's less than or equal to. So if I choose right tail, it's X is greater than or equal to, and I said 2, so I'll put 2 in there. And that gives us our answer. And now that, and of course, there's other options here too for the different case, other cases. But that's how you'd use this um, the salt tool uh, for the binomial distribution.